Well, today is the last day of Black History Month, and to commemorate a month-long celebration of history, culture, and tradition, one local annual tradition carried on today. It's the South High School Black History Month Luncheon, an event full of performances, food, and community. 17's Michaela Armstrong in studio now with the story. Michaela. Jim, this luncheon has taken place for decades, but those I spoke to say there is something special about it that could keep it going for years to come. Music, performances, and food that draws a line, all key elements of the long-standing annual South High Black History Month luncheon. The luncheon is a tradition of more than 30 years at the high school, and teacher Stella Alfred says it continues because of the community. It's the people, the school, the teachers, and the students. Students at the school perform during the event, including students Serene Evans and Jasmine Haney. Both say the event is special and makes an impact on embracing their cultural identity and honoring their ancestors. But I don't have to feel like the odd one out and I don't have to change the way I act, the way I speak, the way I look because the people around me look just like me and I have no reason to be ashamed of that. One month can never hold our history but at the end of the day it is amazing to celebrate you know such amazing people and amazing people who sacrificed themselves in order to give us a better future. The food, which included yams, mac and cheese, cornbread and more, remains the biggest part of the luncheon, bringing community together for a day once a year. Alfred says that moment bridges gaps. That is not always possible. They see the value in us getting together as a people, not just African American people, which this is that this event is for Black History Month, but all the other students get to see that, oh, okay, you know, this is a culture that I can embrace and become to love like my culture. The next luncheon will be next year, but those I spoke to tell me it will be worth the wait. Michaela Armstrong, 17 News.